so caught up in the middle Thinking of drowning in those blue eyes I'm losing sight cause I am falling I'm so deep down, deep down And it's not a lie That I die I can't hide I'm brewing my morning coffee, making a bulletproof coffee right now, and all I do is use the Kerrygold butter, just two tablespoons, about a tablespoon of organic MCT oil, and then just an espresso pod. This little handheld blender I got from Amazon, it's so cute. This would be perfect for frothing like your creamer too or something like that, but I love using this for my bulletproof coffee because it blends everything together. Good morning, you guys. I feel like it's been forever since I've vlogged getting Scarlet cereal, by the way. Uh, I feel like it's been forever because things have been so incredibly busy. I'll explain here, oh God. <laughs> I'll explain here in a second. But today I'm gonna do a day in the life video. We have a really fun little day plan. And I feel like I have a lot to catch you guys up on. Happy Memorial Day, by the way. Today is Memorial Day, so um, thank you to those who have sacrificed their lives for ours. We love the military. Ty was military, he's an army vet, and um, we take this day very seriously. So I hope everybody has a good day, but also remembers the true meaning behind what today means. We are hanging out in Scarlett's playroom right now. I just turned on. Anya and Elsia off of YouTube for her. Hi, sweetheart. Here's your cereal. She's waiting for her cereal. Just got Scarlett her cereal. I got my coffee. It's like 8.30 in the morning. Okay, first of all, Scarlett, what are we doing today? Do you want to explain what we're doing today? We're going to paint some statues and we're going to, we're going to, to the splash pad. Yeah, why, what are we calling today? It's a special what? It's a special girls day. A special girls day. We're having a mommy daughter date today. So I've been wanting to take Scarlett to the painted or the pottery painting place. I think it's called As You Wish here in Arizona. And I'm so excited to take her. She literally lit up last night when I told her we had an appointment booked. So we're doing that today. Very excited. So that is what we're doing today is painting some pottery. We're going to go to our local splash pad to pick up my keto meals because I am still keto. I am on my fourth week of keto feeling amazing. I feel so, so good. So yes, cheers to four weeks of keto or starting my fourth week. I've been having a keto coffee or a bulletproof coffee every morning. And I feel like this is the number one way I get in healthy fats first thing in the morning. I got back from my trip, my girl's trip um, on Wednesday, last Wednesday. So less than a week ago, but I have not vlogged since before that trip because life has been so busy. I just, I'm one person and I just cannot keep up with all the things going on right now. If you follow me over on Instagram, you probably already know, but we're launching our kids swim line, me and my friend Chantel with her shop Forever French. So it's the Forever French, Caitlin and I are collaboration and we have um, three different designs, three suits for boys, three suits for girls. They're all matching, coordinating so cute and you guys have been really seeming to love them and i cannot wait for them to launch so stay tuned for my next video i actually like share all of the things about the swimsuits and um some behind the scenes and all of that or if you want to see what the swimsuits look like before they launch and before my next video you can go over to my instagram and check them out because we have been sharing over there as well so yes that's been happening and getting ready for a launch is a lot it's a lot so this is kind of like a test for me to see how we're going to launch our business in hopefully july um but that's soon approaching so we'll see but it's, this is good practice for oh for um that when that does happen. How cute is this cup, by the way? Scarlett got this from a birthday party this it's past weekend. It's Quinn's birthday party. You know, it's not the Quinn that lives next to me, though. Right, it's the other Quinn. Yeah. Oh, and then one more big update because you guys are too good over on Instagram. I posted like one thing sharing my food and you could see just like a very tiny bit of it, but you guys were able to totally tell. And that is that I got my new rings. <laughs> So yes, I'll share these up close in a second. But yes, wait, I'm wearing wait, my rings. Before you leave. No, we're not engaged. Before you I leave. I know it's confusing. Don't we picked these up last 
week, and as soon as we got them in, Ty was like, you can wear them. I was camera? like, okay. So yes, I'm wearing these. Let me just quickly explain like what a proposal means to us too, because I think there's a lot of confusion happening on this, because I know a traditional proposal, you get the ring, you see, you see the ring for the first time, but these don't really, I mean, they're pretty. I love them, but they just don't, they, they're just an object and um, I guess what I'm looking for and what he's looking for because he still says he's proposing is more of just an exchange of words and a commitment and not necessarily a physical item. So that is what I'm talking about when I say Ty still wants to propose. I'm still looking for a proposal. That's what I'm talking about. Um, that means more to us than physical items. I'm not going to lie. These are beautiful and I love them, but... Um, they are just a physical item. That is what we mean by a proposal. And I know a lot of people don't understand that because traditional ways are so set in stone for some people and there's nothing wrong with that. But we are the most non-traditional people and so we see things differently. And um, I also don't think there's anything wrong with that. So that is what I mean by a proposal. So hasn't happened. Yes, I'm wearing rings because they're beautiful and Ty told me I could. I came outside so you guys can see them better, but um, I did a solitaire setting and then the wedding band's right underneath it. We got them at Shane Co. And oh yeah, there's River. Hi River. Um, but they are rose gold and they're too big. So I have this little like thing on the back of it. I'm gonna get them soldered together because the size down I can't get over my knuckle, but they said if I get them soldered together, it might fit a little bit better so I am gonna do that probably next week um, but this little like plastic piece on the back of it is kind of helping it fit a little bit better but yes here they are <laughs> so um, definitely my dream rings very grateful the reason I haven't got these soldered together yet is because we are actually taking wedding photos like we're redoing our wedding pictures um on thursday so in a couple of days and i wanted to have these obviously for that it's basically a style shoot for my friend bailey who's a photographer and um it's basically just a way for a bunch of like photographers and uh, videographer and um like the dress company makeup artist hair they're all going to be able to use the content for their marketing purposes and ty and i are basically the models but it's also really fun because we're going to have these beautiful dressed up wedding styled photos too. So I'm really excited for that. My dress doesn't come in until Wednesday and I hope it fits, but um, we got Ty a new suit and uh, it's blue. It's like a light blue. It's gonna be so fun. Sorry, it's like talking to the cat. <laughs> Um, so yeah, that's happening too this yeah. week. So we have a busy week with the wedding photos. Scarlett starts camp too. She's also testing into kindergarten early. So we have her test for that this week and then um, our swimsuit launch. So this week is gonna be insanely busy. <laughs> it's river rolling around. Oh my gosh, these plants, these, I think they're called bogobitas. They just make a mess. We have to get this cleaned up. Oh my goodness, River. Look, she's licking her paws. That means she's cleaning her paws when she does that. Ew, I don't like to lick, lick them when you're dirty because, because that means you swallow it. I know, it's pretty gross, huh? But that's what kitties have to do. That's how they stay cleaned. Those are our neighbor's cats, by the way. They come over mostly every morning to say hi, and Scarlett loves that because we don't have a cat, and we, we never will have a cat because I'm allergic. Ty's allergic. They don't anymore, but River comes back today. Oh, okay, okay. Um, so they're like our cats we'll never have, but it's fun to be able to see them outside at least. Hello guys. Let me show you what's in here though, guys. There's some Smarties, and then there's another Smartie. And let me show you my bubble gum. And this is my button makeup. This is my Rapunzel I painted, and this is from my dolly that shows her dolly, and this is her friends on the back, her sparkly friends hair. I think this is a real band, I don't know. This is Batim makeup too, and this is Batim, uh, I don't know what this is, but okay. this is a Netflix, it's a Batim Netflix for me. I mean, not Netflix, necklace. This is real lipstick. I mean, real lip glass. I think this is eyeshadow, I think. I don't know. Or maybe it's for your cheeks. 
Well, I lost the ever white sparkly one. I'm sorry, guys, but there's more stuff. And here's this to brush your hair. And my mom already brushed my hair, see? Oh, nice and beautiful. And look at my dress, guys. Bye, guys. Okay, guys, it's 10 o'clock in the morning, and I'm going to eat a like a weird meal right now. It's like 10 o'clock, but I'm going to eat lunch because we're going to be gone. And I'm so excited to eat what I'm eating. I made this last night, briefly shared it on Instagram. This is by far um, one of my favorite keto recipes I've made like yet. I'm going to heat it up in the air fryer. This is a spaghetti squash mac and cheese. So it doesn't look the best right now. I'm going to heat it up and then top it with some white cheddar cheese and eat this before we go because we're not going to be home for a while and I know I'm going to get super hungry while we're out. I also always get asked about these little silicone containers. These are my favorite storage containers and they're plastic free, BPA free. I'll link them, they're from Amazon. And then the recipe for the spaghetti squash I followed, um, I found it off of Pinterest, so I'll link that below too. It's so, so good. The macros of it, let me tell you. The macros of half of a spaghetti squash approximately is 485 calories with 11.9 grams of that being net carbs, 13 grams protein, and 41.1 grams fat. Okay, here she is. So, so good. This is seriously one of my favorite recipes I've made. You guys have to try this. Even if you're not keto, this is delicious. The only thing I did differently is I added heavy cream instead of milk. I just took all my vitamins and they're like stuck in my throat right now. It's like the worst, it's the worst feeling. Scarlett is eating a Lunchable back there and we are actually on our way to Target before there, we go. There's a cracker stuck in my throat. There is? That's the worst. It's like stuck right here. It needs to go down. Um, we're on our way to Target because we have to pick up a few supplies for her camp. They're supposed to bring like their own markers and coloring stuff. So I thought that'd be a fun little thing for us to do today on our girls trip together. I'll let Scarlett pick out her stuff. It's like a day camp that she's going to at her school they're doing and it's like like every week is um, a Disney theme. So this week is Bugs Life. I just spilled water everywhere. Um, she's only doing this camp a few days a week. And then she's doing a theater camp too, but that one isn't until July and that's like an Elsa theater camp. So just really pumped about that. Okay, what's up guys? We actually just got out of Target and I'm gonna do a quick little haul uh, we got a few random things and i thought i would share scarlet loves these so we got a big bag uh, of I'm pirates booty yeah we also got a small bag that she's eating now and then i just got some makeup remover wipes i got another lunch box for scarlet's lunch and of course she picked out jojo siwa she was very excited about this and this will <laughs> This will fit um, this bento box really well. So I've been wanting to get her one of these and now that she's doing camp and gonna be starting full-time school here soon, she's gonna need one of these. So I got her this bento box. These are nice because it's just easy to make a lunch when it has all these little containers and it comes apart really well too um, for cleaning. So yeah, I think this will be great. I also grabbed her some new like sandals. I thought these were so fun for summer, so bright and fun for like going to the pool. I grabbed a smaller ice block. We have these just not in a smaller size. And then I grabbed her some things that we can do at home. Scarlett has really been into like mathematical equations and um, addition and subtraction. That's like one of her favorite things to do and she's really good at it. Honestly, like she can add anything um, if, as long as it's like a single digit number, but she's incredible at it and she's good at subtraction too we're still a little iffy on subtraction but we've been working on it okay what is five plus two seven good job she is a queen at adding addition and then I also got her this um, kindergarten learning pad this has <gasps> she doesn't know I got her this <laughs> This has so many activities in here and she loves workbooks like this. Can I see? Yeah. Want to look at it? Yeah, yeah. So we'll do that when we get home. Yeah, she had no idea I picked that up for her. And then I just got random things for camp. So glue and markers and colors and colored pencils. And then we just started switching Scarlett's earrings out. So I grabbed her some more earrings and these were so fun because they have little bugs. And tomorrow for camp, it's a bugs theme. So she thought that was fun. So we'll switch out our earrings later. I got something for myself and that is a dish mat, <laughs> grown up things, and a 
drying rack. Anyways, that's everything. We're gonna drive across the street now to As You Wish, which is where, sorry, I'm being yelled at, which is where um, we're doing the pottery painting. I'll be for our girls trip is getting some ice cream. What kind did you get? Um, strawberry. Strawberry with sprinkles. I got nothing because. What is up you guys? We are home. I forgot to show you what our pottery looked like and we don't pick up till Saturday, but we had fun. Do you have fun, Scar? Yeah. Yeah. Um, I've been doing like a little bit of work at my computer. She's been resting, but we're gonna switch out her earrings. Which ones are you gonna put in? These shiny ones, these ones. Which ones? The sparkly ones. We've only changed earrings one other time before. Please don't hurt them. I'm gonna be gentle, I promise. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. They won't pull because you didn't stand for a long time. Yes. Ow. Ow. Okay, we're all better now. <laughs> what do you think? A good dress. I can't kind of see my kids. I think I need to see them in the mirror a little bit. Do you see them? Yeah, I can see them up close. Do you, do you love them? Are they everything you ever wanted? Sparkly earrings? Yeah. I forgot to tell you guys. So at the Pottery Place, Scarlett painted this cupcake and it has like a lid, like the top part comes off and she's gonna store all of her earrings in there. So and now you can take them off. Yes, so she can put them in there. So she'll have somewhere to put all of her earrings. And I got, like I made like a little jar like that too for my jewelry. So we both made something for jewelry. And then also I was like, well, we can't come here and not make something for Ty for Father's Day. So Scarlett made him a mug. He's going to love it. It says best dad ever. So original, I know. The plan was for Ty to get a um, smoker for Father's Day, but now he's talking about switching his car and, and getting something a little bit bigger so we can, like we really wanna start going camping. Um, super random, I know, but we just don't have the right vehicle to go like off-roading, I guess. And we want to be able to put up a tent like on top of the car and go camping, that kind of camping. So one of our things we've been wanting to do is trade in his car. It's a Focus RS, it's like a sports car. Anyways, long story short, we want to trade that in, get a bigger car that we could potentially take camping and put a tent on top and head up north and go camping in the summer. So his heart's kind of set on that right now. So we might be doing that instead of the smoker, but I always like to still do like something small. I usually do some kind of gift basket or small gift bag of random things. So um, like things he needs and then something special. So the mug will be the something special. Anyway, Scarlett, you and I, we're gonna clean up really fast, okay? And then we're gonna put swimsuits on, or you're putting your swimsuit on. Yeah. And we're gonna I'm go to the splash it. pad to end I'm this girl's it. day. We're working on subtraction yeah. right now. Mm -hmm. so these are the means? flash cards I got her today and then these little counting pairs are from Amazon. So We've had them forever. Five. Oh yeah, five, five, five. Mm -hmm. five. Yep, you're right, you're right, yeah, yeah, you're right. All right, so we're still on five. So five minus one. So five, take away one. How many left? Four. Mm -hmm. Good job, Scar. Andy back here wanting his toys out. Oh, did you get it? Did you get your toy? Good job, Andy. Good job, Andy. You were able to get it. You want me to throw it? You gotta let go. If you want me to throw, ow. <laughs> They're working on subtraction back there still. Did she get it? Um, we've been home for a little bit. Ty met us up at the splash pad and we just kind of hung out out there and let Scarlett play. Her neighbor ended up coming with us so she had a friend. I just ordered eight boxes of Magic Suit cereal. In case anybody's wondering, my discount code still works because I just used it for myself. It's Caitlin N. Um, and it's five dollars off, but I bought four boxes of the cocoa and four boxes of the peanut butter and get this I was just talking about this 
last time I got them in, I was saying it's really good to mix the chocolate and the peanut butter together. And they actually just came out with a chocolate peanut butter cereal. So I was like, hey, I thought of that. Anyways, Scarlett has a friend over. So she is in the playroom with her friend. I just made them dinner and I also packed Scarlett's lunch for camp tomorrow and just got like all of her stuff ready. Now I'm just sitting down relaxing. Ty is on the computer um, looking at this car that he is, I guess it's not a car, it's an SUV, that he is, I think he's gonna get. It's reserved in his name and once he makes his mind up, he usually makes his mind up. And it's pretty cool actually. Um, it is a 4Runner and I know that's always been like a dream car of ours is a Toyota 4Runner. And I think we found a really good deal um, through Carvana. Anyways, I just took a pregnancy test and it was negative, so boohoo to that. Definitely could still be early, but, and I know it's not like first thing in the morning, but I was like, I should probably take one, but no, negative. I'm gonna end this vlog here. I have a bunch of things I need to do tonight and I need to just wrap up this video. Don't forget on Thursday, we're launching our kids swim and there's a limited amount of sizes. I'll be sharing all the things in my next video, so, Stay tuned for that. But they're going live at 10 a.m. Arizona time, so Pacific Standard Time. I'll have a link to Forever French Baby down below. If you guys go sign up for her emails, she's gonna send out a 10% off code. And then on top of that, she's also going to be sending out an early access code to shop. So you can actually shop an hour before the launch and then you can make sure you get the correct size. So again, there's gonna be three girl styles and three boy styles and um, for the swim, the sizes are ranging from newborn to 8.9. There's very limited amount in the 8.9 sizes. But again, I'm going to share all of, all of the things in my next video. And if you want to learn more about our swim launch, I have a lot of posts over on my Instagram feed to talking about all the things. So I'm so excited. I'm so excited for Thursday. Um, but anyways, thank you guys for watching today's video. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye. <laughs>